Yemenis have suffered the devastation left in the wake of numerous wars. Women in particular have suffered disproportionately heavy burdens as a result of the war. They have faced tyranny rooted in far more than conflict, from child marriage to discriminatory legal systems. Wives, mothers, and daughters bear the brunt of men's absence, taking on new responsibilities with no prior preparation. As men pack for war, economic responsibilities get relegated to women who are faced with a sudden need to market and to provide. This relegation of tasks resulted in a shift in gender roles, and although the role shift has elevated women's status in society, it has also caused a spike in the rate of domestic violence as men start to feel emasculated by the change. Women's rights organizations have reported the persecution of women who voice their opposition to the Houthis. Women also face prevalent arbitrary detention, physical and sexual violence in prison, and unfounded prostitution charges. Those most affected by the extreme levels of disease are women, among whom are breastfeeding and malnourished who are at higher risk of contracting cholera. Despite the risks, women may feel less likely to seek medical attention owing to a lack of autonomy and control over household resources. All the while, girls sadly remain a currency for war-torn households. Destitute families have married off girls as young as 8 years old in hopes of rectifying their financial situations. Forced and early marriages of girls have tripled in the last years, and nearly 1 in 5 households are headed by women under the age of 18. Despite the obstacles stacked against them, women continue to be vehicles of positive change. They play an important role since they are in charge of allocating resources and educating family members about hygiene. While the conflict has affected all civilians, Yemeni women in particular have borne the bulk of the distress. Various afflictions such as economic inequality have left women more vulnerable to the effects of war.